You know how you're always looking for coach drivers who can act simultaneously as bartenders. Well, look no further. I can highly recommend Paul and Brian Garrett. Paul, I cannot believe you have ever done a manoeuvre like this before. No, I've not. It's not an easy challenge. Brian, what are the particular difficulties you've got to encounter? We've got high crosswinds today, and I think we may have some difficulty getting all of the one we'd like into the glass. So it may just blow away? That's right. I'm more worried about your coaches, really. You're going to need a lot of skill. How long have you been driving? 31 years. And you, Paul? Eight years. Well, 39 years between you should just about do it. Just a word of warning, though. Remember, even if you are successful, you're going to have to drive home, so I get first dips on the glass of wine. OK, get to your caps, please, and let's manoeuvres commence. in the left-hand bus at a constant speed holding the glass. Brian is doing all the manoeuvring in the right-hand bus. Remember, Brian only has the time on the clock or the wine in the bottle to complete the challenge, and he's wasting an awful lot of wine. See you again. All right. Well, I, th I think you did remarkably well. It looked impossible to me. It was very difficult. Very difficult. What, what was the most difficult thing about it? Um, getting the bottle sufficiently close to the glass yeah. um, and, and trying to get a straight for the wind didn't help at all. Anyway, I'm sorry you didn't get the award. I think you should have got it, really. Never mind, you have a scroll. Ladies and gentlemen, Paul and Brian Garrett. <laughs> <laughs>